Welcome to the Dave Show. My name is Dave, and today I'm here to talk about this air purifying system by Dayette. Now, they did send me this product for review, but they want me to show you what it is and how it works. Uh, first of all, this thing is good for up to over 1,700 square feet, so that's a nice size room, house, office, building, anything like that. It has a four stage filtration system and an H13 true HEPA filtration type thing. It just means it's going to take out a lot of the pollutants and smoke and uh, pet dander and allergies and all that stuff out of your air. If you're looking to breathe better, that's what this thing is for. So let's go ahead and take a closer look at this and see how it works. Okay, here's what the unit looks like. It's really, really nice. Um, you do get a manual with it and a remote control. So this is cool. You can control this from across the room, which is really nice. I'll show you the details of this in a minute. Uh, also, you're going to have this special note in here. It says that the power cord is inside the air filter area. And uh, you also want to make sure you do this because there's plastic on it. So on the bottom of it here, I'm going to see if you can see this here. On the bottom, there's a little thing that we're going to take out. As you can see, there's bag over it. It's not going to work with the bag on it. Inside, there's a little surprise. There's a, the power cable in here. So you need to take this out and you need to take the plastic off the filter. So we're going to do that now like that. And, and this filter, this is the four stage filter. There's like a filter on the outside, a filter here. There's the, the charcoal filter on the inside and there's there's other stuff. There's like, it says four stage filter. So a lot of filters uh, and that goes right up inside the bottom. Uh, so you wanna make sure you do that. It just, this is all one thing, it's all part of it. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and put it back in here. There you go. So now that part is there. And then on the back side, here is where you will plug your power supply in. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. Okay. Also they have handles here on the sides. So it's easy to pick up and carry if you need to. The fan is here at the top part and all the controls are here at the front. So I'm going to bring you in for a closer look at this. One more thing about the remote here. You do need to provide your own AAA battery. So I have them. I'm going to put them into the remote. If you're looking at the front control panel right now, there's a power button. Now these are sent touch sensitive. They're not really buttons. You just have to touch it and it's gonna go on. It's doing its sensor stuff. Now this has its own built-in sensor, air sensor. So when the air is bad, um, it will kick up the power to it. Uh, pretty nice. But there is a uh, fan speed here that you can adjust. So if you hit that, I don't know if you can hear it, but it's going up. And this is your little particles indicator kind of thing. Go up. And then there's turbo. So three speeds, turbo or auto. So you can set it to that. So manual or auto and then back to there. Now there's also a little sleep button that will continue to have the thing run, but it's run very, very low and all the lights turn out. So it's easy for that. Um, the HEPA filter thing, this has to do with the, uh, when the filter is needs to be replaced. It will show you there and you can just press and hold it. And then there's a timer also. So now you can just hit the timer. So if you want this to go on for only like two hours or, or whatever, you can go from one to 12 hours by just pressing this button all the way to 12 and then off again. And then there's a lock button. If you press and hold that, it locks it. So you, if you have kids or whatever, you, they can't come in here and press anything. Um, you have to press and hold it again to unlock it. Um, so it's very simple, very easy. Again, this is an automated system. Um, if you have it set to auto, this will um, adjust itself to whatever the air is sensor. There's a sensor built into it. And then, of course, you have your, your um, remote control, which does everything else, too. It's got the fans, got the HEPA, got the lock, got the night, got the timer. Or you could even turn it off with the uh, remote uh, very simple and easy to operate. Um, oh, and the other thing too is on the uh, the display panel, you saw it was blue and, and when you turn it on, it flashes. If it goes to red, that means your air quality is bad. It's just a little visual indicator on your air quality, but very nice unit. Um, even on the low speed, it's not very uh, loud at all. It's very silent, um, but you can kick up the turbo. Uh, you can hear it, but it is going to be cleaning the air out uh, a lot quicker and faster that way. So if you're looking to breathe better air in your home or office, it's a good idea to get an air purifier and this one may be the right one for you.